welcome back. My name is Rhonda. Thank you very much for coming. Please click the thumbs up button for me and please consider subscribing if you haven't already done so. If you have, thank you very much. I love you all. I have a couple different things I want to address in this video. I have my Morphe palette that I want to show you all that I did the, the unboxing or the haul. Look at that. It is just abs those colors are absolutely stunning. The you cannot see. I don't know why it's not showing them in the full glory that they are, but it is just absolutely stunning. And while I'm putting my makeup on, like I said, I figure I'll try my new things or anything new that I have so that I can show you all my first impression. If there's anything that y'all would like to see, let me know and I will see if I have it or if I can get it. I mean, I don't have tons of money with the little one with special needs. Money is very tight. But if there's anything that you're interested in seeing, I will be glad to see if I have it or if I can get it. I wanted to show you all this because this is beautiful and I specifically chose this palette because I know you can't really see it, but it is that at least what I'm seeing that looks blue, but it's really a beautiful purple. I mean, it has all these gorgeous purples that for some reason look blue on my camera. But I chose this palette because of something else I wanted to talk to y'all about. I promised that I would check into this and let y'all know about this. Uh, if y'all know Debbie, or her, or she goes by Deb Debuton on YouTube, she's been on there for I don't know how long, but she is one of the first people who welcomed me when I decided to do my channel and told me to just be myself and basically go with it. Well, she has, let me tell you, this disease that's called Durkham's. And she gets tumors all over her body and it has put her in a wheelchair because she gets them on her joint. She, she gets these, they're benign tumors, but they're causing her major pain and she has been accepted into a trial study and she has to leave her home and travel, I think she said, 18 hours away and be all by herself in a little hotel-like place for three months while she does this study. It could be longer if she gets in the placebo part because then she has to stay longer for them to do the actual medicine. So this medicine is hopefully going to dissolve these tumors and hopefully get her back on her feet and get her out of this pain that she lives in daily. She was hand selected to participate. So a lot of people were doing collabs to, to raise money or raise awareness to her condition because she's gonna be away for some time, except I think she said she's going to try to do lives from her hotel room, but they're doing a GoFundMe. Her daughter set up a GoFundMe, and I'm going to try to link that below. There's another YouTuber. I cannot remember her name, but I will link it below that is selling a, a, a really pretty highlighter that she actually named Debuton. It's a pretty, I think it was a purple. I'm going to order it. It's 15 and she's going to send five dollars of everyone that's ordered to Debbie to help her through because this is going to be a financial strain on her having to pretty much support two homes right now because she has to go so far away on her own she has no choice but to get a hotel so I'm going to put those links below if there's anything anybody wants to do I'm sure even a dollar would be helpful I mean, anything would be helpful because of everything she's going through right now. And I'm sure a lot of you all know her. And she's just, she's just a really, really sweet person. And this is just a really, really great thing that's happening for her. So 
if all you can do is pray that this works for her, I'm sure that will be, I mean, it's, that would be huge too because, you know, we know that not every trial works. So let's pray that this really works and gives her the relief that she needs. I was looking to make sure I'm not missing anything to tell you all. So I chose that palette because purple is her favorite color and there's so many purple colors and purple, beautiful purple shades in there. And I wanted to let y'all know, I know I don't have a whole lot of subscribers yet because I just started three months ago, but I'm sure some of you know who she is, if not all of you or most of you. And I just felt like I needed to tell you all, like I said, I'm going to do my best to leave the links below so that you can check out her GoFundMe if you can do anything at all. I will look and see. I think she even has a direct PayPal link. I will try to include that. And I will include the other uh, lady's YouTube account where she's showing about her blush if you want to go check out her. I mean, her highlighter if you want to go check it out. I mean, it's if you do it that way, you're helping Debbie and you're getting something for it if you think of it that way. So, I mean, it's it's up to you, but I just really felt I've been in situation like that and you all know I'm dealing with it, at least one tumor here and all the glands and they don't know for sure what all's going to happen or what's causing every, the swelling and I've gotten even... I didn't even know you had glands down here where but I'm even getting starting to get swelling down here in the back of my neck I didn't know you had glands there but they're starting to swell so I understand how scary it can be so please consider doing anything you can if you can't financially help in any way just please say a prayer for her and I'm going to do my best to try to get this hurried along so that y'all know my camera for some reason I don't know if it's because it gets hot or if it has some kind of self timer in there I don't know what is going on I'm trying to see if it shows anything but it's not showing anything on there and I've done YouTube chat studies on it looking at other people talking about it I, I don't know why in the world it keeps shutting off on me and I have not figured out how to edit yet, something I really need to do, but I've been so busy with getting my health checked out and everything that, and getting the videos, I have not figured out all there is to edit. I think I was going to check out some, I've seen some of y'all use, I got hair, I was trying to get in my mouth, Kind Master or something, I'm, I've got that to watch some YouTube videos about. So... I wish this would show that, I mean, these purples are just absolutely stunning, but hopefully it's not that way when I show the video that you can actually see they're, they're not blue, they're purple. So, let's see. I actually don't recall ever wearing purple eyeshadow because it's always, I've always felt like I just couldn't pull off a color like that. So I am going to try this. Like many of y'all remind me, it's just makeup. It washes away and it's late. I'm doing these videos for y'all. This will be washed off as soon as I'm done. So I'm going to go in, which you can't really see. That is a beautiful purple color, not to it looks very blue. I really wish that Morphe did not put their colors on these. That is called Grape Grape Mines is what that is color is called. I wish y'all could see that that is purple. Let's see. Can you see that that is purple when I put it on? I just did a video on the, the Morphe lips. If you want to watch it where I explained 
the rest of the makeup I have on. Like I've said, I'm not a beauty guru. I'm just somebody having fun experimenting and sharing what I'm learning as I go because it might help someone. Like I'd said before, I remember telling y'all that I've wanted to start my channel for two or three years and I kept thinking it would be embarrassing because I've gained so much weight when my thyroid went out and I kept saying, telling myself when I lose the weight and feel comfortable with myself I will start my channel and then one day I just decided hey my journey to get healthy might help someone else so why hold it off even if it is a little bit embarrassing like not having makeup on in a video that's embarrassing but I'm getting more comfortable with it last month I said I would probably could not imagine ever doing a get ready with me and showing anybody me without makeup but I'm doing it and it's not that big a deal because I really truly care about you all and I decided to go ahead and start my channel one day thinking it just might help someone else maybe it would encourage someone else to realize you're not alone this is something so many of us have to deal with especially us women as we get older I do have thyroid problems and I'm wondering if that has anything to do with that. I don't know yet. The doctors haven't figured it out yet. And I do have Hashimoto's, which the thyroid is right here. The doctor did comment on one of my papers about it being thyroid related. But even the nurse said there's no way because the thyroid is here. And this is here. So I don't know. We will find out soon enough, I guess. And I'm determined that I'm going to lose this weight. I am so sick of being, feeling fat and ugly. And I'm not saying anybody's ugly because you're fat. Please don't think I am. That's how I personally feel because I know society, it's about society, makes us feel that way, but I love fashion, I love pretty shoes, I love all the things that it just gets harder and harder to wear and look good in, and I mean, I like high heels, but as you get heavier, it's really hard to walk in high heels. I want to lose this weight. I have got beautiful clothes. You might not be able to tell by my video, but I really do have beautiful clothes. I have really good style, but I absolutely refuse to even try to buy nice clothes in the size I am now because I refuse to, to acknowledge that I might stay this size because I'm not going to. There is that one color. I think you can actually see it's great on, can you? I really think, I think it looks like a great color, purple color, whatever, on the camera, but it doesn't on the pan looking at the camera. So that is just the one color, the grape, what did I say it was called? Grape Mines. I like that name, that's cute. So, let's see, I think I'm going to go with a darker grape color here, purple color. Let's see, what color does that say that is? That says, make it rain. Yep, that says, let's make it rain. So, let me try that. See, it's kind of hard to, to put it on on the little tiny viewfinder thing on the camera. But I don't want y'all to think I'm not, that I'm ignoring you or whatever when I'm way over here. At the, I did get my, 
my mirror right here instead of down below me like I had in a, another video because at least this way I'm right here at your level that's really pretty I like that I might actually feel comfortable wearing purple because this is a really pretty color I'm trying to get out of my comfort zone too and that is a beautiful purple color That is just the darker one. I wish I didn't have hooded eyes because that makes it really hard to, to wear some of these really awesome colors or awesome designs. I love people when people do the, the cut creases and things, but I've tried several times. I cannot pull it off it looks crazy I just don't have enough eyelid space but I'm gonna keep trying but it just I mean you see I just I don't have enough eyelid space I know you go up above